But anyway, I'm just gonna build this observatory here. Oh my goodness, look at this. Holy jeebus, man. This is freaking gigantic, dude. There it is, Vesper Station. What a view, man. What a beautiful view we have here. Oh, oh boy. Oh boy. Oh! All right, hello everybody. Welcome back to another episode of Subnautica. And today, our plan is to build another base. But this time, instead of going all the way to the bottom of the ocean, we're gonna go up to the skies. That's right, we're gonna build the tallest base in Subnautica ever. And uh, this is this is what I have so far. It's pretty, pretty impressive, if I do say so myself. It's really tall. This is definitely not something to scoff at at this point. And uh, we're gonna continue to build this all the way up. Let's jump out of here. That's right. Oh, boy. So let me just show you what I got so far over here. So this right here is the entrance. It's right at the... Um, it's right at sea level, basically. So we are in here. And let me just add some windows so you guys can see. So at this point, we are still underwater. So this is the first level. And it's, it's looking pretty okay. You know, it's shallow waters. Nothing, nothing fancy here. But if we go one story up now we are right right at zero meters as you guys can see we are right at the edge looks pretty cool from here but we can continue to go up here and just keep going up and i do have some windows here i don't have them all just yet we're gonna continue to add some decorations and windows and stuff like that so we can appreciate the um you know the view right here we are really high and uh i think over here i might delete this section I think that's what I'm gonna do. Hold on, let me delete this because we're not gonna we're not gonna use this. I've been doing some testing, by the way, so that's why it doesn't seem symmetrical at this point. I think I'm gonna add possibly some observatories here on this section, and on, uh, let's delete that right there. And this section is going to have this path because we're gonna need it actually to be able to build this. Now you might be wondering why does it have two? towers well the reason why is because you cannot build through this um through this piece of metal here you have to build like this in diagonals so i'm gonna show you guys how to do this if you want to follow my lead and be epic gamers you might be wondering holy crap this is such a big endeavor man you must be on a different caliber of a gamer like that's right man i'm a i'm on a different tier in terms of gaming here <laughs> So what you actually have to do is build two towers. So from this tower right here, you're gonna place the other story on the other tower. And then from there, you're gonna place the other one and you're just gonna serpentine all the way up to success. <laughs> so that's what we're gonna do. So we're gonna do warp and we're gonna do minus 180. 0.5 then we're gonna add 2.5 to this so, so that's gonna be 31.8 right and this should teleport us right above this pad wow. yeah look at that we are out here in the middle of the night and what we're gonna do now is just build following um level there and let's just do some some parkour here balance this out and there you go so this is all we have to do and uh, we just have to keep doing this all the way up to low orbit. It's gonna be tough, man. I'm not gonna lie. This is a very tedious, tedious endeavor. So I'm just gonna continue to do this as long as my sanity allows me to do it. So I'll see you guys in just a second. All right, let's build some windows here. All right, all right, all right. We're pretty high already, I would say. Uh, let's do that right there. And let's do this over here. So now that we have reached the upper level what we need to do is as you guys can see you could do this as well but it's not going to be perfect and it's going to be way more difficult and the other problem is that let's say i place this right here right there it is it's placed i can't actually build it so i can't actually build this from here there we go and let's build it right there and i think we should be able to go like three stories from here and uh, we should be on our way to become the biggest base, the tallest base in Subnautica below zero and maybe even in Subnautica itself, man. I'm not sure, I haven't seen anyone do this on YouTube before, so I think it's pretty, pretty unique. And uh, if you guys enjoy it, be sure to subscribe for some more crazy videos like this one. I'm such a next 
caliber gamer man. <laughs> oh boy. So let's do this right here. There you go. So, and by the way, I've been doing building games for quite a while now. If you guys go back to my older uh, No Man's Sky videos where I do custom builds, I do like to push the game's uh, boundaries and see what I can actually do. And let me tell you this, I think there's not gonna be a height limit in this game because I don't think the, the developers actually predicted that someone would try to do this. We'll see what happens and it's getting nighttime, so I'll see you guys in just a jiffy. All right, boys, so we are pretty high already here. <laughs> we are about 59 meters above sea level. It's a bit, it's a bit tedious, to be honest, but hopefully once we get to low orbit, the payoff, it's gonna be amazing. The view is gonna be glorious. So let's just keep doing what we're doing and let's keep building here. Now, I'm not sure if I'm gonna add decorations to this whole base because let's just say it's gonna be very big, but hopefully you guys know how to do this already. Let's take a look at this from, from below, all right? Before it gets nighttime. Holy jeebus, oh my God. <laughs> oh boy, that is quite the building right there. <laughs> that is quite the jump. All right, that's pretty cool. All right, I'm gonna keep building here and I'll see you guys. I'll see you guys in just a second. All right, boys, so we are close to 100 meters above water. And uh, let's just say that uh, the game is having a little bit of trouble rendering these things. For some reason, whenever I place one, the game is like almost at the verge of crashing. So I'm getting a little bit worried here. Like, look at this, look at this. Do you see that? It just, it just sort of, sort of like freezes for a second there. So I have to be careful here. We are nearing 100 meters above, above ground, above water. And uh, the, the space station actually looks quite close here. Look at that, it looks pretty close. I'm not sure how high it is, but uh, it's looking pretty close here, so. I'm just gonna continue to build this. We are almost at this height right here. So yeah, hopefully we'll be above the clouds in, in a couple of hours. <laughs> anyway, oh, God dang it. All right, let me just keep working on this and I'll see you guys in a second. All right, so we are beyond 100 meters. There is a freaking snowstorm going on. We are nowhere close to the freaking low uh, atmosphere but we're pretty close to that thing right there and uh this is this is quite scary if i fall from here nothing's gonna happen but it's gonna be a pain to get up here again it's funny how uh the uh depth meter doesn't register when you're above water so it's just it just says zero meters when clearly we are way way past that <laughs> so anyway i'm gonna continue to work here uh, I guess I'll see you guys back when we are higher than that mountain right there. So yeah, it's gonna be quite a while. See you guys then. All right, boys. So we are getting pretty high up here now. I'm still building all the way to the top. And once we get to low orbit, I think I'm gonna expand um, like sideways. <laughs> Not getting fat. What I'm trying to say is I'm gonna add some more like, I don't know, rooms to these to this building. Like right here, these two pillars are just foundations for what's gonna be the real base up there. And uh, it's gonna be freaking amazing. It's gonna be, it's gonna be huge. We're gonna have observatories. We're gonna be able to look down upon our, our planet and stuff like that. So I feel like it's gonna be pretty good. So, and of course there's a freaking thunderstorm going on right now. It's so freaking loud, dude. Holy crap. What the hell, man? Jesus Christ. But let's just say that the view is, is really, really freaking good. And by the way, guys, building with this storm is pretty, it's, it's not cool at all, man. It's not cool at all. And this is what I have to deal with right there. The game just freezes every once in a while, but that's fine. That is fine. Holy crap. Anyway, I'm gonna keep building here. Hopefully I'm not gonna fall off the, the building. All right, boys, so it's been about an hour. I would say we are a little bit closer to the station. We are almost at the tippity top of this mountain. And I just wanna show you guys how freaking big this build is, how freaking tall it is. So I'm gonna go into free cam here. How freaking big this 
build is. It's massive, dude. Look at this. <laughs> Look at this right here. Hold on. Let me just remove all of this crap. Look at that. Holy jeebus, man. This is, this is just insane. It is insane. Look at this. It just keeps going. It's even hard to... It doesn't even render the whole thing. That... Oh my god. It's so big, it won't even render the whole build. Jesus Christ, dude. It's massive. It's gigantic. And I still want to see... Look at that. It just keeps rendering. <laughs> it's insane, dude. It's freaking insane. So, alright. So, that's the top right there. And I want to see how far we are from Vesper Station height. We could consider that low orbit, right? So, we're still pretty far away. We're still pretty far away, I would say. Yikes, dude. Still have a long way to go. Like, at this point, we are really high, dude. Like, extremely high. It won't even render the whole build from here. So, I don't know, man. Hopefully, I'll be able to make it there. I want to make it as far as possible, but the game is crashing a bit too often at this point. Look, oh, we're actually not that far away. Maybe a, an hour or two of work. I know, I'm insane, dude. I know what you're thinking. I am. All right, I'm going to continue to do this. Let's see how far I can get before my sanity just decreases to below zero. All right, boys, we are getting closer. There it is. Vesper Station. Can I build so high that I could actually build sort of like a like a bridge, like a connection to Vesper Station? That would be freaking amazing, right? Look at that. It's so close. And the view. Look at the view. Holy jeebus. No one else has seen this before. This is a sight never seen before. All right. Enjoy it, boys. Only on this channel. Subscribe. <laughs> <laughs> All right, boys, so we're here at the top of the world, the tallest base in the history of Subnautica. And one of the things that I wanted to do before completing this build is jumping off of it and seeing how long it takes us to reach the bottom. I'm doing it for science. Let's jump, dude. Let's, let's do it, boys. Ugh. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, ah! no, don't break the fall, you dumb. Oh, it can't even load. It can't load it. Holy crap. <laughs> the game crashed, dude. It crashed. I can't see anything, dude. It froze. <laughs> oh, dude. What the hell, dude? <laughs> All right. It crashed the game. I think that's a good sign. I'm going to take that as a good sign. It means we're making history right here, boys. All right. Hello, everybody. Welcome back. So we are here at the top of our base. And I'm pretty sure I can be confident and say that this is the tallest base in Subnautica's history. Let me just show you guys how high we are right now. We are at 300 meters above water at this point. And we can't see much at this point because we have, uh, we have a blizzard going on. Uh, but there it is, Vesper Station, and I think, I think this is how high it's gonna get at this point, uh, because I just can't do it anymore, man. Vesper Station is at 1,000 meters. I've been playing for about two and a half hours, just building, and we are at 300 meters, so it's just not gonna happen, guys. I'm sorry, but we're, we're just gonna have to, you know, be happy with breaking the record, the world record for, uh, most epic gamer in Subnautica ever, you know? But anyway, I'm just gonna build this observatory here. Oh my goodness, look at this. Holy jeebus, man. This is freaking gigantic, dude. There it is, Vesper Station. What a view, man. What a beautiful view we have here. And over here, we're gonna have our room. Over here, we're gonna have a lab of, of some sort. And let's add some windows as well. Oh my god, look at the view, man. How much would you pay for a, for a flat like this one? Holy crap, you would pay tons of money, dude. Holy crap. This is just amazing, dude. This is just so freaking cool. Like, most games have a limit to how high you can build, but this game just doesn't give a crap. This game is just like, just go at it, boys build as high as you want so if you guys know of anyone who has built 
something taller than this, just let me know down in the comments. But I'm pretty confident that this is the tallest base in Subnautica's history at this point. All right, boys, so we are out here. This is gonna be some sort of like landing platform for some sort of like rocket or spaceship of some sort that would like to get to this base. I thought I would add this just to add it more realism and we have a hatch. Welcome aboard, Captain. Thank you, sir. For some reason, we have some <laughs> some liquid uh, sound effects. Let's add some more rooms here to this build. All right, boys. So this is it. This is the end right here. We have our base. We have two observatories down here. We have a landing pad. Over here, we have another observatory with a beautiful view. Let's take a look at this from over here. We have windows everywhere. So we can see all the, the different sites and all the different vistas holy crap this is beautiful over here we have another one right here then we have the main room on this section and i do apologize if the game is framey or blurry the game just can't take rendering all this all this stuff at the same time so we have this over here we have another observatory it looks beautiful down here we can see vesper station up there and if we go upstairs, we have another room right here, which is all windows. This is the room with the worst frames ever. And uh, it looks pretty cool from here. Let's go up another level. We have another room with two more observatories right here. My goodness, holy jeepers, dude. This looks so good. Look up, look at the station. Look at the station is right there. All right, let me show you how this looks from afar. And there you have it, boys. Holy crap, dude. This took quite a while. <laughs> but I'm pretty sure this is the tallest base in the history of Subnautica. Especially Subnautica Below Zero. Like, look at this. Look how high this is, dude. <laughs> it's freaking insane. It can't even render at this point. It can't even render. Look at that. All the way down to water level there you go so my goodness this is this is literally insane it's literally insane dude i can't believe i actually did it it took a long time but i did it man i did it right here at the top anyway hope you guys enjoyed the episode if you guys did remember to leave a like hit the subscribe button and i'll see you guys in the next one Bye bye